There we go. Anybody got a scale? Oh my God. I don't know. It's a big one though. That lipless? Good grace. <laughs> it might be, man. It might be a little bit bigger. It's got a belly on it. Goodness gracious. She smoked it too. Good God. One hook in her. Let me give her some water real quick. Yo, she's straight. Yeah. Big worm, this time of the year. She smoked that thing, bro. I was about to try to shake. Hands right. Six eight. Mm -hmm. That's a good fish. Six eight. I'll get it on my camera there. Oh. Yeah. Take a picture for me. On debut. Got the old belly there. Huh? Six eight. Mm -hmm. She smoked that thing too. She ain't had but one hook in her. Only one. Six, eight, good grief. Giant. Guys. <laughs> that just happened. Straight. Tank. Giant. Absolute behemoth. Six, eight. On the Bill Lewis original, right there. 15 pound floral. And I'm telling you guys, this rod right here, she only had one hook in it. Look at that. This thing right here. I ain't leaving this point uh, for a while. That, that fish came up and straight smoked it. Casting off this point here. <clears throat> Got some wind coming into this point. Which kind of leads up into a shallow flat here. The reason why I'm fishing here, because you know, in the spawn, pre-spawn, that's what they tend to do. They move up from their deeper holes up into points and then back into the flats. To find those hard bottom surfaces to lay eggs. And this is definitely a hard bottom surface area. That fish kind of looks like it might have been, the tail was all kind of Dark looking, kind of raggedy looking, but it wasn't bloody. But she still got eggs left in her. Ain't dropped the eggs yet. She's definitely up moving to feed. So, first fish of the day, six pound, eight ounce. Can't beat it. I mean, I'll absolutely just be satisfied. Oh my God, got another one. Wait, that's not a bass. Oh, yes it is. Oh my God. Ha! Woo wee. Guess I won't be just catching one fish today. It's one of those days, guys. It's gonna be one of them days. One of those days, that's about a three pounder. Didn't bring my scale, but it's all good. It's 
Okay. Solid, solid fish. That's another. I don't know. It might be a male. So like I was saying, guys, before I was so rudely interrupted by this decent fish, that yeah, feisty too. Let's go back. This is a area where they should be moving up to spawn. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> not playing he was ready to go everywhere that should be moving up the spawn i just hit two fish in what five minutes in between each other or less i don't know either way i think i might have found the actual juice That one ate it. It's on and popping, guys. These fish are not playing around at this point. Not playing around at this point. Teammates left me. I don't know why. Catch him. Just lost that. <sighs> Only one I had in that color. But we're gonna see if they're gonna. If they'll eat this color here. I have. Crawl pattern. You know they like to munch on those anyway. When it comes to fertilizing those eggs. Super king to catch them on a different color. There's not, not a couple more things I want to try. I mean, I'm satisfied with catching catching them like this. I definitely want to try something different. But I started out with a spinnerbait earlier. They didn't work. That's all right. You got it? Yeah, it might be. Oh, yeah, she did. Oh, it's right there. There you go. That trap I see. It is. What? No. I don't know if it is. It kind of looks like one, but it feels lighter in size. That's nice fish, though. She choked it though.
There we go. Yeah. About a pound and a half. They all solid too. Here in a second, guys. Head back on out to that point where I hit this 6A dead. Back in the shallow areas right now. Might slow down a little bit. I'm gonna go back to their flat. Not to their flat, but that point. Here in a second. off of that point. That's been the most productive for me. Like I said, they're on points. On the areas right before the spawning pockets. Last guy said. There. <laughs> I didn't even have a camera on, but there he is. Nice fish, bro. I'll say it goes four and a half. Yep. Nice size fish there. Shaker Z. Mm hmm. Good out here. <laughs> yeah, even the smaller ones are chunky. The one that came off was bigger than this. Mm. Mm -mm. Mine and Jermaine both. Y'all both lost. Y'all both lost big ones. Yeah, bigger than this one. That's crazy, man. Three six, three almost six. three and a half. Solid fish though. He's short and fat. One more weight on him. All of them. You just cast some parallel to that bank right there. Yeah. They all look shallow. Flip some red. Oh, hold up. Three twelve. 312? Yeah, I figured it'd be a little bigger. Yeah, I thought so too. 312 it is. Alright folks, back out at this point. I'm having a lot more success, but we as a whole, we're definitely catching them guys. I've caught four, missed two, lost my original Bill Lewis, but I have this one here in the crawl pattern. You know, those trap tackles I've had on there for a while. Just have to take them off. But uh proud to announce that I am now 
a member of the Vector Hooks family since we uh, had to part ways with Trapper. Now Pro Staff with Vector, so we're gonna make it happen. Either way, but different color now. I don't think it really, I don't know if it really matters. I know they have shad here. I was really wanting to keep that, that shad pattern, the only one I have. I uh, really wanted to keep that one, the simple fact that it kind of matches the hatch. You gotta get a shad here. But, I can make do what I got right now. Oh! <gasps> oh! <gasps> oh! Oh! That's all. Oh my god. He won it. Come back. Is that red here? Stay on, baby. Stay on. Stay on. It's bigger than. Oh, 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 oh. Holy crap. Oh, I need somebody to come bring me scale. Yeah, I need a scale, bro. She's bleeding. I was just about to call somebody. This might be bigger than that 6'8". Six, six. Hey, right before this one, I seen one come up and swipe it. He missed it. That's a giant right there. Golly. Oh yeah, that's eight, seven, eight, easy. Cool. Six one. Mm -hmm. That'll do. Yeah, feisty one too. Good, nice. Anything on a lip loop? Yep, that one right there. Where well, you over here? Over here. Right here. Yep. Come on, you got it. There you go. Mm. about a five. I can't believe that happened. Nice. 
Not him. Yep. Snatched him out of the water. Well, guys, there you have it. Um, I want to start off by saying, first of all, I didn't have a proper intro like I usually do, but I was eager to get on the water, guys. It was, uh, it was a decent. Actually, it was an excellent day. Um, definitely in full pre-spawn mode right now. These these fish are feeding up chunky fat buck bass big females up feeding on uh none other than nothing other than the bill lewis guys this guy right here half ounce bill lewis and the reason why i started out with this well i didn't start out with it i started with i think a spinnerbait i started with spinnerbait then i said okay i know this particular place has shad so why not go with a shad pattern. This is in the gizzard shad, as you can see right there. Gizzard shad, half ounce, Bill Lewis rattle trap, the original, guys. Mustad, triple grip pin hooks. You can't go wrong with that. So, um, decent day, guys. Um, this is no secret. People have been using these for years and years and years, and they continue to use them. And hands down, this is probably one of my favorite colors right here, depending on the water clarity. And not to mention, I did catch one on a different color, a crawl pattern. Um, but he really wanted it. She said, shall I say. But either way, guys, excellent day. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. I hope you guys continue to fish and continue to follow my channel and hit that thumbs up, subscribe, um, and just follow me throughout this, this process of just fishing and, and sharing my experience with everybody. So, guys, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you on the next episode. Peace.